All right, uh, today we're going to take uh, an old microphone that was designed to go with a, a portable cassette recorder, and we're going to use it in, with our Behringer with the envelope follow the feature. So this allows you to take an audio source and create a voltage that can be used. Um, first, what I want to do is I want to take the audio output of this so you can just kind of hear my sound, my voice going through the synthesizer. So I've plugged in here in the bottom left of my blue Marvin. I don't know, maybe in the other devices it's somewhere different. I think in the original it was upper left, but for us Behringer people, it might be down here. Uh, so this would be the audio output. And so in order for us to hear that, we'll just merely take the audio output and go in maybe into the one of the oscillator audio inputs, feeding to my filter. Uh, I'm going to turn for now, I'm going to take the filter all the way up, turn the resonance down, and let's see what we got. Now be aware that there's um, an amplitude sort of multiplier here, so if you want more range on the amplitude modulation, uh, that's going to be your control. Alright, so let's carefully turn this up. I have a speaker right here, so I have to be mindful of feedback. Up. You can hear my sound coming in. Let's see if this is affects the, uh, yeah, it does multiply the loudness out of the speaker too. Okay, so that's, that's audio coming into the device. Um, let's pull up, I'm going to move this to audio three and let us hear, you can hear a sawtooth wave. And we're going to modulate the filter based on the incoming volume because I think this kind of demonstrates what you can do with this. I'll turn it to resonance some, a little more volume. Let's see, what did I say? I feel like I'm getting a slow modulation from my LFO somehow, but I'll rest with that later. Okay, so in order to use it as a, a modulator, <clears throat> take envelope follower output, and then choose one of the uh, controls for the filter here. tap on this. Let's start with a lower. Multiply it times 100. Pretty cool. Times 100. A thousand. Talking. One, two, three, four. Into the mic. Boom. <laughs> All right. Now let's, uh, let's take my voice. I'm gonna filter that. One, two, three, four, one, hey. One. One, hey, one, two. One, hey. One, hey, one, two, three, four, five, six. So those are the settings for using the envelope follower uh, with the Behringer ARP 2600. The microphone into envelope follower. Uh, to get the audio out, if you want to hear that, you come out here, go somewhere like one of your audio inputs or your filter, and then take the, the envelope follower, if you want to use your voice or whatever as a control voltage, and you take it where you want it to go. Okay, hope that's helpful. I'll see you guys.